Severe winds rip through the area along with high surf and cold temperatures. Yeah, let's go right to Kimberly Cheng. She's live in Redondo Beach for us tonight. Hey, Kim. Hi, and today there was concern over large breaking waves with dangerous rip currents at beaches, including here in L.A. County. It was recommended that people stay out of the water. Surfers hit the water by Redondo Beach Pier Thursday, despite concern that strong currents could pull swimmers out to sea. It was super windy last night into this morning, so it brought some waves with some swell. And now the tide is going down and the wind's calming down, so the waves are going to get pretty fun. With potentially dangerous rip currents combined with high surf affecting Malibu Coast, LA County beaches, Catalina and points north. Experts advise people to stay out of the water or stay near occupied lifeguard towers. We found many enjoying the large waves from a safe distance. It's pretty awesome to see. To, to some people, it may be scary, but but I, I'm just intrigued by the, by the ocean and nature. When we first came out, it was a little more windy, but then it kind of calmed down a little bit, so it's nice. Away from the beach, many experienced cold and windy conditions. In Riverside, trees swayed in the wind and trash cans were knocked over. A plow was seen clearing up snow in the Tahone Pass, carefully leading vehicles through. A similar sight in the San Bernardino Mountains, where drivers dealt with icy roads on Highway 18. For some, it was painful putting on chains when temperatures were in the low 20s. And back here live, experts say there could be some minor coastal flooding with high tide tomorrow morning. Reporting live in Redondo Beach, Kimberly Chang, KTLA 5 News.